Star Lords and today I'm going to be doing some kind of new glitches on Pokemon Brick Bonds. I haven't really done these before and uh, yeah, a couple of subscribers actually told me to try these places as, you know, when I actually showed off the Salamance board glitch where you kind of go sideways through a building, everyone was kind of hyped up about that and they wanted me to try it in a few spots so I thought why not, let us just try it, see what happens and hopefully we can find something crazy or maybe a future kind of spot where things are going to get added into. Uh, so anyway guys, before we get into the video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already to the channel. Uh, so here we are today in Antion City, we're here with a couple of friends right here, here they are, hello everybody, how you doing, how you doing there sir? He's got a bucket on his head, which looks kind of crazy, and he's got a nice board. Uh, but anyway, what we're going to do is, from Antion City, we are going to try this glitch in one place really quickly. So what I'm going to do is talk to this lady. Lady? Lady. Right? Probably. Probably a lady. I don't really know. Maybe it's a dude with some fruit on his head. We don't really know. Uh, but anyway, once we're on uh, Kragnos Peak... What we're going to do is go forward into this cave right here, into the Kragnos Mines. Uh, but before I do that, guys, I'm really quickly just going to go to Menu Bag and turn on my Max Repels. And um, let's do that. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so I'm not really sure if this will work. I do believe that Robosloth Gaming actually kind of did this once before, but I wasn't able to do it as we didn't know how to do the Mega, Mega Salamance board glitch at the time. Uh, okay, so people wanted me to actually see what's inside this little room here, and uh, yeah, I was kind of curious myself. I kind of forgot about this place even existed, but I was like, wow, okay, I really want to get in there. So what we're going to try and do is first we're going to... Whoa, okay. <laughs> okay, what happened there? Uh, we're going to try and go through this area right here. We're going to see if I can kind of go through this little wall, um, and if not, we'll try and go through the actual wall itself, uh, rather than these bricks, because um, what I'm assuming is that these bricks are going to be very hollow, whereas these will be very fat, and uh, the fatter the object is that you're trying to get through, the harder this glitch is. Oh, we did it! Oh! <gasps> we've done it! I think we've done it! Oh my god! Have we done it? No! Did you see that? There is a room behind here. There is a room behind here. Okay, okay. Wait there, wait there, wait there, wait there. Okay. I, oh my god. I did that perfectly then. I did it perfectly. Wait there a second. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Come on. This is the hard thing about glitches sometimes. You gotta try them forever and ever just to try and get one glitch down. Honestly, I'll be honest with you guys. Back when I used to glitch in 2016, I remember me and my big brother actually stayed up around about nine hours trying to do one glitch. Just one glitch we were trying to do for about nine hours. And once we actually got around to doing it, we were like flipped out like crazy. My mother was asleep where like that in the bedroom going, Yes! We did the glitch! And it was like... Oh my god, and then my mother's just like shouting, Will you two shut up? <laughs> I'm just like, okay, I'm sorry. But yeah, we tried it for like nine hours. That's like dedication. That is like dedication to being a glitcher, I'm telling you guys. But look at that. It kind of gets me in there, but then kind of glitches me out. So what I'm going to try and do is I'm going to see if it works here really quickly. Maybe it does, maybe it doesn't. Okay, okay, so it definitely doesn't here. Let's try and get out of here a second. There you go. What if we do it here? Here. Well, here. Let's have a look. No, okay. It doesn't work there. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. Chill. Chill out. Chill out, Star Lord. What's through there? Oh, wait. Maybe it works there. Wait. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's glitching me further in. Right. Can we just get out? Can we get out and try the glitch properly, guys? Okay. Maybe we try it like here. Here. Because I didn't see like another wall. Oh, it's hollow. It's hollow, guys. But I don't know whether it's... It, it might not... Oh, my God. Oh, I am now a wall. I am now a wall. That's flipping out. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus Christ. What is going on? What is going on? Oh, did we do it? Wait, what? 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 Okay, no, it's not. Okay, wait there a second. Let's try this. We can do that. We can actually do that. Come on. Oh my god, we're so close. <gasps> we did it! Oh my god, we did it. We did it. We did it. Oh my Jesus, we actually did it, guys. We actually did it. And we got into, like, some weird little section thing. What the heck? This map is crazy looking from the outside. I've actually been on top of this map before, but I've never been, like, inside it. 
like underneath it kind of thing. What is this? There's that room. There's that room. So we're gonna wait. What is that down there? Oh, it's nothing. Okay, okay. So this is the room that we were talking about. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try and get inside it. Hopefully we can find like some kind of new thing or something. Maybe there's like, I don't even know, a Pokemon Sprite or something. I don't know. Well, let's try it. Okay, okay. Wow, that was simple. Okay, okay. Um, okay. There's nothing in here. There's nothing in the wall. What is this? What are those? No, but seriously, what is this place? I'm confused a little bit. I mean, it looks like it's gonna be something in the future kind of thing, because I mean, you know, if they were gonna, yeah, you know what, actually, yeah, this could be something in the future, because normally if they're going to kind of add something uh, that you're not going to, like say if they add a door into the game and they don't want you to ever go through that door, like there's gonna be no updates for it in the future or anything, it's just gonna be a door, a random door, they wouldn't add a room behind it. They would just make it a door on a wall, you know? So maybe, just maybe, this little ruins area may be something in the future. And maybe these wall things, like these things right here, will like kind of be opened up or rock smashed or something. And then maybe there might be something here. I don't know. It looks like something could be on this. Like, I don't know. Like, you see the way this is, like... You know, like the way this is kind of here, and maybe there could be like a Pokemon standing here, or maybe like an item or something like that. You never know. Like, it seems like, I don't know, I think that possibly this could be something in the future, maybe. I don't know. What, what do you guys think? What do you guys think? So, yeah, I'm a little bit disappointed by this. I thought that there was, some, was going to be something different uh, in the future. Like, I don't know, I thought there was going to be something actually in these rooms or something like that, if there was going to be a room in the first place. I don't know whether we should actually check down here, but yeah. What I'm going to do is I'm actually going to go to the second place that people want me to go to now. Uh, because, you know, oh wait, okay, yeah, we can't use this here because we're inside a cave, technically. Duh. So from Brimber City, we're going to go through this little root extender right here, uh, going back on ourselves. And um, there's actually like a room that I'm really interested in to see if it's got some kind of significance. Uh, so let's go through this little area right here, continue on down, and we're gonna go left up here, and uh, we're gonna go to the graveyard. Uh, so the person who actually commented this had the same kind of, um, I guess he had the same kind of idea as me, that this little like kind of shack thing right here may actually one day be accessible, and maybe be the place that we find Mimikyu. You know Mimikyu, that cool ghost Pokemon that kind of mimics uh, Pikachu? Yeah, I genuinely feel like this is going to be in this house at one point throughout the game. And hopefully it's going to be like an event kind of Pokemon where you can only catch it like one time a year or something like that. Uh, but yeah, what we're going to do is really quickly kind of check what's inside that. And then I guess we can check what's inside this over here. Uh, so yeah, I don't really think that there's going to be much in here. Maybe it might not be even be accessible. Um... Okay, yeah, it's it's not accessible. I mean, it is accessible, but there's nothing there. But yeah, I don't know. I think that there is probably going to be some significance to this little building in the future. It's probably going to be Mimikyu, guys, honestly. And uh, Mimikyu is like one of my favorite Gen 7 Pokemon. Genuinely one of the best things that Pokemon have ever came up with, or Game Freak, I guess. Uh, so yeah, I don't know. I, I kind of knew that there wasn't going to be anything inside of here. But still, it was requested, so I do want to check it out. But I genuinely haven't checked at the uh, like at this place before, so I really don't know. Uh, so let's kind of go to the back here. Maybe we can go inside and... Oh god, oh god, what has happened? I am now a floor! Hello! Okay, uh, yeah, I don't think that we can get inside there, guys. It seems to be like it's just a brick, and uh, yeah, I don't think it's ever going to be any... Oh my god! What just happened? What just happened? Wait there a second. We did the glitch, the little launcher glitch, guys. You know on the people? What the? I come here to try and get inside it, and we and we glitch it. What? what is, how did we do that? How did I do that? Really? No, how did I do that? Come on. Come on. Oh my god, what? What? Guys, we've just found like a new launcher glitch. Look at this hiding spot. Imagine playing hide and seek with glitches one time on this. That would be amazing. That would be so cool actually to do a video on that. 
We can do like a hide and seek Pokemon Brick Bronze Glitchers Edition. That would be so cool. Oh my lord, that is amazing. That is insane. I don't know. Maybe I'll try and see a Foey and uh, little big gamers and uh, a couple of other people want to actually like get in on doing like a glitching kind of episode where we kind of like play hide and seek in Pokemon Brick Bronze, <laughs> but like kind of do it with glitches. I don't know. Would you guys like to see that? If so, comment down below. I would like to know. And uh, yeah, I will definitely like kind of if I see enough people saying yes to it, I will uh, definitely get in touch with Foey and Little Big uh, and see if like uh, you know they want to do a little glitches edition of Pokemon Brick Bronze hide and seek. That'd be pretty cool. I don't know. Maybe we could make a series where we hide and seek on like certain parts of the map i am like a genuine pro at this oh my jesus oh my lord i don't even know what is going on i don't even know with this pokemon brick run flow i i don't know sorry guys for the cringe uh, but yeah anyway guys that is pretty much all i've seen when people are asking me to try different places uh, this little house over there and that little uh, kind of mine area uh, so guys if you do want to kind of uh, recommend me any kind of areas for me to try and glitch feel free to do so in the comment section below and uh, i do hope that you enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to leave a like and as always subscribe to the channel have an awesome day and until next time i mean star lord oh see you